Hey there, TikTokers! As you know, this March the 8th is International Women's Day, a perfect occasion to remember some of the female figures that have marked our history. And this time, we would like to remember the first woman programmer in history. Augusta Ada Byron, known as Ada Lovelace, was a talented English mathematician and a pioneer in the field of computer programming. She was born in London on December 10, 1815, and was the daughter of the famous romantic poet Lord Byron and Lady Annabella Byron. Ada didn't spend much time with her father. Known for his love affairs, Lady Byron separated from her husband shortly after Ada's birth. A few months later, Lord Byron left England and Ada never saw him again. He died in Greece when she was only eight years old. The little girl had an unusual upbringing for an aristocratic girl from the mid-19th century. She studied literature and music along with astronomy and mathematics. It is believed that her mother thought that feeding the rational and objective part of her brain would prevent Lovelace from developing her father's unpredictable temperament. Although she couldn't prevent Ada from being fascinated by her father and from considering mathematics a poetic science. Sadly, due to a severe unknown illness, she spent a long time unable to get out of bed. But far from being discouraged, she took the opportunity to let her imagination fly. Excited by the idea of flying, she was determined to invent the machine that would allow her to move through the air. She spent years studying the anatomy of birds and creating her sketches for her project. From the beginning, Lovelace showed a talent for numbers and language. At 17, one of her tutors, Mary Somerville, introduced her to Charles Babbage, a well-known mathematician and inventor who was impressed by the young woman's intelligence and knowledge. Immediately, they started a voluminous correspondence on topics related to mathematics. Ada was fascinated with Babbage's ideas. Known as the father of computing, he was the creator of the differential machine, a mechanical calculator. In 1834, Babbage had plans for the construction of a new model of calculating machine, a general analytical machine that would become the antecedent of the modern computer. Ada married in 1835 to William King, who became the Count of Lovelace three years later. They had three children together. Ada and her husband shared their love for horses and socialized with many of the illustrious minds of the time, such as Charles Whitstone, Michael Faraday, and Charles Dickens. It was 1842 when Ada translated an article written by the Italian mathematician Luis Menabrea about the analytical machine. But she not only translated the original text, she also added her own thoughts and ideas. The article ended up being three times longer than the original piece. Those notes were the origin of her fame as the first female programmer in history. Ada described how codes could be created for the device to handle letters and symbols along with numbers. She also described concepts such as the loop and the subroutine. She wrote a program that allowed to calculate the values of Bernoulli numbers and how to perform trigonometric operations that used variables with the machine. And also, she detailed the use of punch cards. Her work was published in 1843 in an English scientific journal. Ada signed with her initials to avoid the censorship of the time. But still, her work was relegated to the background until years later. Lovelace didn't have a strong health. She had problems with asthma and her digestive system. Her last years were somewhat stormy. The nervous breakdowns, debts, and scandals followed. She died of uterine cancer in London on November 27, 1852, when she was only 36. She was buried at her request at the cemetery in Nottinghamshire. In 1979, the Department of Defense of the United States recognized the contributions of this young woman and created a programming language in her honor called ADA. Ada Lovelace is considered to be the first female programmer in history, a woman ahead of her time who over the years would receive recognition for the great work developed in the computer field. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it, and if you want to see more Draw My Life videos, subscribe to our channel. See you in the next episode!